My name is Amr Al Hassani. I'm an emergency medicine assistant professor. My project is enhancing student engagement during lecture using student response system. Uh, I'm honored to have Dr. Uh, Muhammad Hassanin uh, and uh, Professor Dr. Ilham Yusri to be uh, my advisors. My project was designed to be implemented over one year duration. Uh, basically, a student response system, it, uh, it's a term that is used uh, to describe something that's uh, famous. Uh, we have a, a different term for this, which is called audience response system. But the term student response system, this is the term I found and I'm using because I, uh, I read a lot about this term instead of student response system. Well. As regards the Gantz chart, during the first quarter, I managed to get IRB approval. Uh, that was followed by preparing my team. Uh, my team is basically uh, a very small one. It's made of uh, big in my department and myself. And then uh, I got myself an account for the software I'm going to use. Uh, I bought uh, this account so that I can utilize all the uh, features, the full features of, of the software instead of using the free version of the software which has a limited option. The software I bought and uh, I use called Slido. Uh, maybe you heard about the famous Pull Everywhere uh, software, but the one I use is called Slido. Uh, the reason I use this one is because it contains all the, the needed items I need and uh, financially it is lower than uh, Pull Everywhere. Then I designed a questionnaire for a assessment uh, of student satisfaction to be filled by the student at the end of the, of the lecture. During the second quarter, I updated my lecture to include various types of interactions. Uh, the various types of interaction included word cloud, quizzes, ranking, and uh, multiple uh, choice questions. I started to apply this method to my lecture, which is uh, given to a year two student, both live, uh, live and online lectures. And uh, that was followed by distributing uh, my questionnaire on the uh, student. During the third trimester, which is the uh, trimester uh, or, or the or the quarter, the third quarter we are currently in. I'm gathering all the results uh, from the questionnaire and the software data, and I'm analyzing currently uh, and generating the uh, result uh, for the uh, for my uh, project. I did not finish yet. Uh, on the other hand, the initial picture looks very promising, uh, especially with the high level of engagement and the high level of satisfaction. But during the last quarter of the year or the last of fourth trim uh, trimester, I'm going to uh, to gather all these uh, information, I will present it to my dean uh, to take uh, an approval uh, to spread the, this method of uh, teaching to a uh, whole uh, school of medicine. And I hope that my school of medicine will be able to get an organizational license instead of my personal license. The lessons learned, well, time management is one important lesson that I always, that I, I mean, it will always be significant. We are all busy with our daily task, with numerous activity and times and time flies. So being bound with a time frame like the CAN chart makes it easier for us to monitor our progress. Uh, the second lesson uh, I learned from this project uh, is uh, to be always uh, prepared with a second plan, especially for the unexpected uh, event. Uh, life always uh, surprises us with uh, many unexpected uh, event, and uh, having a plan uh, that is malleable, malleable to accommodate all these uh, uh, changes, unexpected changes, is very important. Lastly, the changes that were made to my project. Uh, well, the major change that my initial uh, project was designed to uh, use this uh, uh, student response system on online lecture alone. Uh, but because of the, uh, the COVID situation got improved much uh, my school of medicine uh, shifted back to the uh, uh, to the live lecture instead of the of the online lecture. This is why uh, I expanded right. the scope of my talk to include both live and online uh, lectures. Finally, minor changes occurred in the time frame because of the change in the student uh, schedule. Yet these kind of minor changes did not affect the overall project at all. Thank you.